Hello everyone, I'm Priya Ratnam, the new director of the Shrewsbury Public Library. It breaks my heart that the library is closed at this time and that I'm not able to welcome the families that visit the library for children's story times or the tweens and teens who enjoy hanging out in the beautiful young adult room or the people who go to the library to read newspapers and magazines or use public computers and study spaces. I miss the people who attend regular programs like the English Conversation Circle, the Memory Cafe, the book clubs, and the myriad educational and entertaining programs that the library hosted. I miss all of our volunteers who enhance the quality of service that we provide. I hope all of you are safe and well and providing comfort and cheer to family members and friends. The Board of Library Trustees, the staff and I look forward to the day when the library doors are opened again and our community center is once again the vibrant, bustling space that we all love. In the meantime, I wish to remind you of the virtual electronic resources that you can access right now. You can download ebooks and e audiobooks through Overdrive. You can enjoy streaming music using Freegal and can stream movies and videos through Hoopla. Genealogy research can be done by accessing Ancestry.com and HeritageQuest. Have you always wanted to learn a new language and never found time to do it? Now might be the perfect time to use Mango Languages. They have over 60 languages you can choose from, including a unit for speakers of other languages who wish to practice their English speaking skills. Magazines and newspapers are available to read online through RB Digital or Newsbank. Consumer Reports Online provides unbiased reports and ratings on products you wish to buy. Learning Express Library has tools for high schoolers such as college test prep and career prep. BrainFuse is a tutoring service for school age children. Did you know that you can take a course on accounting, entrepreneurship, computer training, or any of 30 other topics through universal class? For all you parents who suddenly find yourselves homeschooling your kids, you yourself can take a crash course on preparing lesson plans, and your middle and high schoolers can take courses on history, science, arts, crafts, hobbies, etc. <clears throat> Our virtual library is a treasure trove of resources for people of all ages and with diverse interests. You can access all the free resources from the reference and research page on the library website. There are video tutorials on how to use them on the top of the page. All that you need is your Shrewsbury library card the magic card that lets you access all these resources for education and entertainment. If you don't remember your library card number or need a new temporary library card, please send an email to splcirc at cwmars.org. For specific questions related to online resources, send an email to splreference at cwmars.org. If you would like to reach our children's librarians, please email splkids at cwmars.org or call 508-841-8533 and please leave a message. Library staff are working remotely from 9 to 5 on weekdays and checking messages and will call you back and help you with any reference related questions. They will walk you through the process of accessing the various resources I mentioned. 
You can also sign up for the email listservs to receive periodic updates on virtual services and programs. The link to subscribe to email listservs is on the home page of the library. You can also see icons for Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And I encourage all of you to follow the library on these social media platforms. We've also created a YouTube account and will be adding content to it regularly. Subscribe to the channel, but be patient with us as we figure out how to create recordings to share. Our children's librarians have already created adorable videos with songs and play for children. So please connect with us virtually during this difficult period of social isolation. Remember, your friendly librarian is just a phone call away. April is National Poetry Month, so I would like to share a poem with you that has inspired me since I was a child. These are words from the Gitanjali by Indian Nobel Prize winner Rabindranath Tagore. He wrote the poem in his native Bengali in 1910 and then translated it into English in 1912. His words transcend time and place and his message resonates with us today. Where the mind is without fear and the head is held high, where knowledge is free, where words come out from the depth of truth, where tireless striving stretches its arms towards perfection, where the clear stream of reason has not lost its way into the dreary desert sand of dead habit, where the world has not been broken up into fragments by narrow domestic walls, where the mind is led forward by thee into ever widening thought and action, into that heaven of freedom, my father, let my country awake. Thank you.